I'm Heath Bateman, Public Works Division Manager for the City of Pasco. Previously, we learned about how your water gets to your home. But what happens once you're um, done with it? Well, that's a whole other unseen process. Let's dive into it, no pun intended. Wastewater takes a journey from your drains, is transported through sewer pipes and lift stations, ending up at the city's wastewater treatment facility. The first process screens out large solids, grit, and man-made objects. From there, treatment separates into a solids process and a liquids process. Solids are removed through clarifiers, then anaerobic digestion occurs before drying for disposal. The liquid wastewater continues to the biological treatment processes, the trickling filter and aeration basins. Here, populations of microbiology consume the organics in the wastewater. After a final clarification process, treated water passes through ultraviolet light for final disinfection before being discharged back into the Columbia River. Like drinking water, the wastewater process is continuously tested to make sure it meets government wastewater regulations and is safe for discharge into the environment. We hope you've enjoyed your journey through the Pasco's unseen but always active water treatment process. For Pasco Pulse, I'm Heath Bateman.